Welcome back to another episode of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm your host, Susie Selleck, here today in Sherburne, Kentucky, at the site of the former Sherburne Covered Bridge. Stay tuned. I'll tell you all about it. The Sherburne Covered Bridge was built in 1868 at a cost of $3,500. It connected the town of Sherburne, Kentucky, and Fleming County with Bath County, Kentucky by spanning the Licking River. The bridge was 253 feet long and built by Isaac Kisker. Now for the really unusual points of the bridge. First, originally it was a privately owned toll bridge with the toll keeper's house on the Fleming County side of the river. This house was demolished around 1920. Second, suspension tiers and cables were added by the Kentucky Highway Department in 1951 to help strengthen the bridge. It's reported that this is the only covered bridge to ever use suspension cables in this manner. Third, it was closed in 1977 when the road was realigned and a new highway, Route 11, was opened just 300 yards downstream. On April 6, 1981, the bridge burned when two teenage boys started a fire inside the bridge. Obviously, this was a boneheaded idea because the fire ended up destroying the bridge. Fourth, at the time of the fire, it was the longest covered bridge still standing in the state of Kentucky. Over the years, Kentucky has been home to over 700 covered bridges. Unfortunately, only 11 covered bridges still stand in the state of Kentucky as of today. For watching another episode of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm your host, Susie Selleck, here today in Sherburne, Kentucky, at the site of the former Sherburne Covered Bridge. Hope you enjoyed your time with us and learned a little something. Remember, travel slowly and stop often. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.